day and just these last two games getting how he's better. handled being you know running back number one heavier load yeah he's getting better isn't he um um i think he's um becoming an all-around back a little bit more he's blocking better in protection he's running the ball he's falling forward better i thought he got tired after that long run down the sideline that warren thompson got the holding call on but uh, other than that, I, I thought I thought he played really, really well and had 140 some yards rushing. That's that's 200 yard games back to back. It's pretty good. But um, he's he's a better back than he was a year ago. He's playing well. You offer an update on Catalan Slusher. Didn't, didn't see them out there. Can you? Uh, Slusher was Slusher will be back next week. Catalan, y'all want to talk about that or not? Yeah, I think people want to know what's going on. There's been a lot of stuff out there. Yeah. Catalan is having um, uh, surgery on his shoulder, uh, reconstruction surgery on his shoulder, so he won't be back this year. Um, and I feel for him, you know. And we've 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 had conversations about it, and and um, I'm gonna let him be away from the building a little bit, you know. I mean, he's down. I mean, you would be too, you know. You put in all that work, and for two years, you. You're, you're not able to play. So um, with that, uh, uh, Simeon Blair was the next highest defensive vote getter for captain. So we made him captain yesterday in our team meeting and the team was ecstatic about that. I'd also talked to Kat about that and Kat had also talked to me about it, you know, about since he wasn't gonna be able to come back this year, that it would be nice if, if Blair, uh, was able to be a captain and it just so happened he was the next vote getter. Slush, I believe, will be back. Uh, he was close to getting back this week, but we just felt like it'd be safer for him to come back next week. But I have no doubt that he'll be back next week.